Iri ongeta alede parita kaisa kanyoni kizi de jasne karamo jam anu daitoloti project na lude get geta ora ilude los kintira nwa pol. Kwenye daitu ngaludo karamo jam kizi de ronga iba korom nepeka tiukisho irukumito sinoim ara ide jasi luo joko tawa swa mkech. Kwa nada tukotongi naka NGO Biro, nyezde koto itutore so makalu udo joko tau, aijen, e iponelo da ituloto i projekta na keche mkadukun, edichane kidi ingi kesi kai so makangunu da pugano tomano districta. Remain challenges in terms of understanding the specific aspects that they must look out for in terms of compliance for NGOs themselves, as well as the public officials helping NGOs comply. So that is what we have noticed. There is still more need to build the capacity. There is still more need for district NGO monitoring committees to understand their work. There is also need for NGOs to understand what their obligations are as NGOs. Apart from engaging, we have also found that the reading culture still remains low because you have the NGO policy that was passed by, by cabinet in 2010 and the NGO Act of 2016, but today you find so many stakeholders are discussing it as if it is something totally new and for us uh, that is a concern which I think should be addressed that we need to improve the reading culture because for us to implement these things we need to understand whatever we are implementing. What we need to improve on is one, to functionalize the committees at the district level and also at the sub-county level. As per the NGO Act, most of the districts in the Karamoja region do not have the functional NGO monitoring committee. Aponi dabo ilipike sanyu nebe, etutose kisila luda aswa mukech, nepe kadumu tabalo na ngunude chaete, erongo ichika kinakani, achamna rikai district itoloto iprojecta na kech. The district signs the MOU with you. We want to see your physical address, that you have the physical address. We want to see that you have the three key documents that the director of NGO Bureau mentioned. You need to have a certificate of incorporation from the URSB. You need to have the work permit from the NGO Bureau. Then we need to see the registration certificate from the NGO Bureau. So those are some of the things that we want to see on board for us to count you, that you are, you are a fully fledged NGO working in Moroto, working in Karamoja. So we are also discouraging this organization that are based in, in Kampala, then they just come and do the activities. After activities, they go away. I want to encourage all the NGOs in the Karamoja sub-region that uh, they need to promote the principles of good governance and also they need to promote more transparency. Because it's only through those principles that they can complement the government well because they cannot hold the government accountable and yet on their side they, they still have some issues. Godfrey Eyokum, TV East, Karamoja.